Hey, welcome back to my channel, Riddle here. Today I'm going to tell you about wood ash. So we had a couple good fires the last couple days. It's been unseasonably cool here in Northern California. And once again, living toward a state that nothing is wasted, wood ash is an amazing fertilizer for the garden. It adds potash and potassium which helps plants to uptake nutrients. And I look at my soil not as dirt. You have to understand your soil is a living thing. It's almost like how you would treat your body. What you put in the soil is what the plants are going to uptake and it's what you know those are the vitamins and nutrients that are going to be in your vegetables. So if you use non-organic fertilizer, you're going to be eating nitrogen. If you're going, you know, if you put lots of vitamin and nutrition into your garden, your vegetables are going to have a higher vitamin content. This is one of the arguments about or non-organically grown vegetables at the store. They look giant, they look perfect, but some of them are near nutritionless. Can you imagine that? Just growing something with chemicals and nitrogens and hormones to make them look huge and perfect, but they actually have little to no nutritional value. This is shocking and sad, but you can make the choice to grow normal, vitamin-rich and mineral-rich superfoods just by which how you treat your soil. So, potash or wood ash, what you're gonna do is when it's completely cool, you pull it out of the fireplace and put it a nice thing, and if you haven't planted your garden yet, that's the best case scenario because you can scatter the ash all over the place. But if you've already planted your garden, just gently, just gently put a thin layer. Another thing this will do is if you're using fresh compost or if you've bought fresh compost, or like me, I get my soil out of the forest and our forest is all pine and, and oak, so it's really acidic. This also can act as a lime. So putting it in your compost or putting it in soil that's a little too acidic will help lower the acidity and make a lot of your vegetables a lot happier. Now, if you've got acid-loving fruit like your blueberries or what have you, they probably won't enjoy this so much. And this is basically it. We're just gonna sprinkle our wood ash in between our green seedlings and we got a little misty rain going today and some watering and this will slowly make its way down into the soil and these plants are going to love it and this is just something that you'd have to throw in the garbage or throw out in the throw out in the forest and instead we're going to use it as a valuable nutrient in our garden for free and that's it using wood ash is amazing it helps to balance the pH in the garden and add valuable nutrient to our food if you like my channel, please subscribe. It helps. Take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. Have an awesome day. Bye.